fuck. Hmm. Hello, Anita. Hello, Gloria, Ofelia, Pamela, Gabriela, and Wilfredo. Good evening, sister. How are you? How was your vacation? Oh, I good, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. What did you do? Um, in my home. You spend time at home? Yes. With Gloria? I'm relaxed. No, 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 Ada, Ada. Did you spend time with Gloria? Me perdí. Yes. Did you spend time with Gloria? Did you did you go somewhere with Gloria to eat? Uh, no, teacher, in my in my house. We we stood home. So you stood home. Yes. Mm, okay. Don't you watch any series together, Gloria? Don't you watch any series together on Netflix or something? Uh, um, more uh, TV and uh, movies. Uh, three movies. Mm. I it's um, it's um, it's um, much. Uh, Eat chatarra. <laughs> okay, to eat. Um, it's... Yeah, trash food, trash food, yeah. Yes. Uh, and, and only, only uh, my sister and I in house. It was just the two of us. It was just the two of us in the house. It's just the two of us in the house. Okay, what's your favorite thing to do, girls? When you want to do something together, what do you prefer to do? Eating pupusas, going to the movies. She 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 like uh, um, very very pupusas. I am. Uh, she likes pupusas a lot. Really? Okay. Let's see, Ada. What does Gloria like? Gloria, I like the full. Mm -hmm. Pasta? Gloria loves pasta. Okay. Gloria likes pasta. Really? Yes. Yeah, you know, I was thinking one of these days that I haven't eaten um, pasta with albondigas in a yes. long time. Hmm. <laughs> with meatballs meatballs oh my god oh my god my brain yeah meatballs i love pasta with meatballs i haven't eaten in a long time what is what is a dish wilfredo that you haven't tried for a long time excuse me teacher would you repeat the question please yeah what is a dish you know a food that you haven't tried in a long time let me see. Fiambre. Fiambre? Yes. What? Is, what? Uh, have you tried it? I, I think I have, but I don't remember right now. It is a typical food in Guatemala, for example, for the um, Dia de los Muertos. What? Yes. Okay. It is. It is. Um, it is a mix uh, about different embutidos. <laughs> really? Yes. Wow, but uh, it has vegetables too, right? Yes. yes. It is a, a wow. relajo. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Instead of saying relajo, they said fiambre. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but I remember 10 years ago, I remember in Guatemala, 
when I I stayed and stood, there. stood, uh huh. You stood there. Stood. Stood. Uh -huh. Stood there. Uh huh. I you guess. stood there. Uh, yes. And my my with my wife, we went to to spend with her family. Then my my mother-in-law, suegra. Yeah. She asked me if I I I want to to try it. Oh yes. But I remember that I I, I enjoyed it. Okay. I'm correcting myself actually. To stay, stayed, stood. Will you write, please, teacher? Yep, yep. Stay, yeah. stayed, stood. You were right. And you can say when we were when we stood, stood. there. Uh, we we stood, we stayed. And you can use this word, teacher, when you are you you are talking uh of the past yeah but on the past that's past that's right it's present past past participle that's right uh what about you uh gabriel what is the weirdest food you have ever tried weirdest uh, i don't know <clears throat> maybe sope papas really <laughs> yes here in el salvador that's the weirdest food you have ever tried Yes, in fact, I, I am a person who eats uh, the maybe the same food like pasta, um, hamburgers, fish, meat. I, uh, I think we all do. We all do that. Yeah, exactly. But for me, it's a pepata. I don't know that that uh, that that consistency and the thing that it's inside. I don't know how to say that. Oh my God! You're eating the 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 bulls, uh, the bulls the nerve, basically. Yeah. yeah, the nerve, the the, the feet, exactly. basically. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's, for me, uh, it's a little disgusting. I, I don't I don't like that. Yeah, too another much grease. Kind of, exactly. Another kind of food. If it looks weird, I don't even try to taste it. Yeah, they say that everything goes through your eyes, right? Exactly. <laughs> Even love. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. Let me see. Anna tell me. What is kind of kind of the same question? What is the the most difficult dish that you have ever tried? In other words, let's say you went to visit someone. Anna tell me, you went to visit a boyfriend, you know, when you were younger. And they said, and, the, and his parents were like, oh, try this, eat it, eat it. And you were like, okay, yeah, thank you. Delicious. <laughs> I love the old dishes. Um, old dishes? You... I eat. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And what's the yeah, weirdest? It's difficult for me to, uh -huh. to identify a specific dish and dislike something that you dislike do you like pacayas thank you and it's not my favorite dish, <laughs> Gabriel, really? for me yeah. <laughs> okay <laughs> okay uh walter what is the family you know the relative of pacayas the one they used to to build to build los cercos you know the fences on, on the ranches you know, you know what I'm talking about, girls? With lemon in beer, say the Gabriel. <laughs> Gabriel with lemon in beer. In boquitas, Gabriel. Oh my God, <laughs> lemon and beer. No, but there, there's a family member of Pacaya or something like that. And it's something they use to build the fences, you know, where they have the horses, the cows. How do they call that? I can't remember. It's some sort of tree. Okay. Walter, have you ever tried um how do you shoot this? Excuse <laughs> me, teacher. Excuse me. Excuse me, Walter. Have you ever tried shoot this? I don't know. I don't understand, teacher. Okay. In soup, teacher. In soup or in al wash. Chufles. <laughs> Chufles, right? Yes. <laughs> Chufles. 
And, and those are like snails, snails shells, right? Did, have you, sure. you have never tried a chupe? No, no, chute. no. <laughs> chute is like, yeah. <laughs> Teacher, I, I hear uh, chutes. Yeah. Say avocado. <laughs> oh, do you know what? Wendy, I have been looking for chutes for three months and nobody sells chutes anymore. I don't like. You don't like chutes? Is, is the cousin of avocados. No. <laughs> okay, guys. That was typical food, Salvadorian food. What's what do you got for me? Okay, I need someone to tell me how was your weekend, your long weekend. Was your long weekend, teacher? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. It was weird, actually, because I don't know. I, I try to rest. I try to rest, but it felt different. I, I felt that I had to, to work. And actually, yesterday, well, since Saturday, they have been going crazy on the, on the call center. And they are offering overtime, a lot of overtime you do you know what is overtime yeah ot ot yeah. Ex, extra hours so man it was crazy uh, thursday friday they were paying like 24 dollars per hour so i was like oh my god but no money is not everything for me i had to be with my family so i i just started yesterday I, yesterday was my day off but still I work. I work like I work like three hours, and today I worked four hours. So, and I'm gonna be working four hours every day because I have nothing to do in the afternoon. So, um, Don Bosco used to say that you have to be busy all the time, right? So, I like to be busy all the time. Okay, let's do the attendance. It's really late already. So, before we get into a topic. Ada Patricia Linares Galdames. Present. Excellent. Adriana Stephanie Martinez Flores. Ah, present. Hmm. Okay. Oh, got you. Thank you. Ana Selmi Cheves. Present teacher. Thank you. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Edwin Alexander is not here. Flor de Maria Carvalho Garte. Present. Thank you. Gabriel Ignacio Lara. Present. Thank you. Gabriela Alejandra Gonzalez Flores. Present. Thank you. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Here. Okay. <laughs> Julia Patricia Vázquez Santos. Julia, Julia, oh my God. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. Present teacher. Okay. Nelson Edgardo Sanchez Ramirez. Nelson is not here today. That's weird. Ofelia Orellana Arce. Ofelia got disconnected, but she was here. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Good evening, present. Thank you. Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Good evening, present. Roselena. Good evening. Hello. Ah. <laughs> Sandra Gladys Mendes Ramirez. There she is. Hello, Stephanie Elizabeth Ayala Perez. I saw her. Stephanie Elizabeth. I can see her. Yeah, she might be in the university right now. They changed her schedule. So, Susana Carolina Hernandez Iraeta. Hmm. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Good evening. Thank you. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Teacher, sorry, it's the dark. It's, it's dark. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Thank you. Hey, that's a good series, by the way. Dark. If you haven't watched that on Netflix, it's a great series. Dark. I, I, I watched it twice. I saw it twice already. 
It's a great theory. Okay, who remembers the last topic we talked about? You remember? It was identifying needs in my department and defining tra training needs in my department. So what was it about? Hello. Really quick, who remembers something about last training? I mean, the last session. Identifying. We were, we were, yeah, we were, we were doing exercise without exercise. Exer exer Exercises. With, with, with joint conjunctions. Joint, really? Yeah. Paid conduct, paid conjunction. Mm. My God, I forgot. Yeah, so, some <laughs> sentences, right? Paired conjunctions, yes. Paired conjunctions. Paired conjunctions. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was part of it at the beginning of the class. But then, then we our main topic was identifying training needs in my department. What you need in your department, remember? What training needs you have. And the last thing we did was uh, I split you in groups, you know, and, and, and then you started talking about uh, your job and what you need to do at work. So, huh? Teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Okay, got it, Wendy, don't worry. Hope you get better. Okay, so let's continue. Tonight, uh, I would like to start with a little exercise that I found. It's very interesting. Um, it's on your WhatsApp. So in groups, you're going to determine or just tell your classmates what's the best answer. It's just paired conjunctions again. And then we're gonna work on a specific topic. Uh, let me give you an example of that chart that I just sent you. So let's combine using not only, but also, okay? How would you do that? In winter, days are short. They are also cold and dark. How can you use not only, but also in that example? Not only you will stay home, teacher, mm -hmm. but also you can go to see the, for example, the, uh, how do you say that, the atardecer, teacher? The sunset. Sunset. Mm -hmm. When the sun sets? Yes. Right? Okay. I'm okay, okay, okay. Hey, no, but the point is to use not only, but also. So in the winter, the days are short. How do I do not only in that sentence? In the winter, the days are short. Flor? Exactly. In the winter, not only the days are short, but also... Mm -hmm. They are cold and dark. Or I could just say, but also cold and dark to, to avoid the, to avoid sounding redundant, right? Good job. <laughs> Come on guys, wake up. Let's see. In winter, not only the days are short, but also cold and dark, you see? And you have a lot of, exercises on that chart that I just sent you. Por favor, no le den click a la lupita para que le salga la respuesta, no sean tramposos. Y si le dan click, um, denle refresh a la página para que se les revuelva todo y puedan volver a empezar, okay? Okay, so the point is just let your classmates 
participate, give your options, okay? Let's practice just for 15 minutes and we come back to do something else. Let's go. You can share your screen if you want. <laughs> en la página donde vamos a practicar Adriana <coughs> no es que nos envió entonces hay que ver el enlace. Okay. Ahí está el enlace. Nos está colocando el enlace. ¿Ya? Uh -huh. Ok. Yes. Hoy. Study pattern conjunctions. Vamos a buscar el... Either tú o Sara will help you with your homework. They are both busy at the moment. Um, either Sue and Sarah will help you with your homework. Mm -hmm. Yeah, neither Sue nor Sarah will help you with your homework. Mm -hmm. They are both busy at the moment. Uh -huh. Yes, because it sounds negative. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Neither there are not. Neither nor. Neither. Neither, neither, neither nor, nor sad. Sad. Nor. Mm -hmm. Neither. Mm. But is the right position the nor in the second part of the sentence? Neither. Uh -huh. For me, it's neither Sue nor Sarah will help you with your homework. They ah, because are they, they are busy. The exactly. Okay. Exactly. Okay, the right answer is neither nor. Exactly. In this case, it's possible to write. Ah, yes, neither to. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's right. Okay. In the second. Uh, when I go to the restaurant, I ate... Either food. or. Either. Sell me, sell me. Hi, teacher. Hi, can you do me a favor and hit F11 on your keyboard? Podría presionar función F11 si está desde su laptop o solo F11? In this moment. Huh? Right, teacher. There you go. Thank you. Luego, para, salirse, ajá, para salirse de la pantalla completa, escape. igual vea F11 ajá, or escape. Ok. Thank you, teacher. When ah, this is complete. Mm -hmm. Either and or it's right. Is okay. Combined, combined. Not only but also they need food, they need food but also mm -hmm. medicine. Mm -hmm. 
Uh -huh. they, need, they not only uh -huh. need food, but also need medicine. Or they not only need food, but also they need medicine. Mm -hmm. But also medicine, no. Because yeah. need and need, I think. Yes, yes, it's possible, but, but also medicine. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. yes, but also medicine. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. It's right, it's right. Yeah. He has been late for times. Oh, yeah. Let's see, Pame. Pame? Combine you seen not only, but also he has been late for times. He hasn't done any work. Okay, not combine only. the not only, but also. He has been late for time. Mm -hmm. Not only he, he has been late four times, but also he don't, he hasn't done any work. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, change change the, the pronoun. Yeah, but that's a that's an error from the site, I guess. But yes. you got it. You got it right. Yeah. Good job. No need. In this case, change the the position of the bear. Not only has she been late mm -hmm. four times. Not only has he been late four times, but she has also he has also not mm -hmm. done any work. He hasn't also. You can also say he hasn't also done any work. She and. I mean the the, the subject change. Uh -huh. it's, a, it's a mistake from the website. Ah, Don't worry. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry. Mm -hmm. But I confuse with the when is right. The change the position the third teacher. On the first the... on the first sentence when there's an auxiliary. On the first sentence, when there is an auxiliary, you you bring the auxiliary to the front, not only, and then the auxiliary, then the subject and the verb. Okay. The, when, the, the, when, when always there, the structure is that. That's the structure when there is an auxiliary present. You bring it to the front. Okay. Mm -hmm. keep, keep going so you can see other examples. That's okay. the best way. This. This is my offer. Teacher, teacher. Hello. I, I have a question. Mm -hmm. um, the one is the structure the the oración is a. Uh, Convenient, you say not only, but also. 
There are problems with our children. There are problems with our parents. Is correct. Uh, not only there are problems with children. With, with our children. Mm -hmm. uh, but, but also. All, uh -huh, there are problems with their parents. Uh, you don't need to repeat the whole sentence. So not only there are problems with our children, but also with our parents or, or no. but also our parents uh not also the parents correct ah, okay you don't need to okay. repeat the whole sentence no tienes que repetir toda la oración ah, ajá. son redundantes si repetís toda la oración ah okay uh -huh. okay thank you you're welcome Ahora, el punto de ese ejercicio es que todos participen, ¿verdad? Si alguien puede proyectar los ejercicios en la pantalla e, e ir diciendo, por ejemplo, vaya, le toca a Ada, ok, next, Sandra, next, Walter, next, Ofelia, ok. Y van haciendo un ejercicio cada uno, o por lo menos intentándolo, ¿verdad? Ese es el punto. I don't okay. I don't, y, el, I don't y el enlace no lo pueden mandar aquí en este chat. Donde yeah, no. yeah, right now, sí, sí, sí. Mándelo, voy a ver y lo puedo yo abrir. Of course, of course, of course, right away. Ok, thank you. You're welcome. Here you go. Okay, thank you. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello. Uh, I I I confuse when when the, the, the when when the, the exercise uh, only okay is good. Oops. Uh, only it's bad. Okay. Yeah. The point is, or the point is, uh, to have someone sharing the screen. For example, let's do it together. So, for example, the first one says, I'm going to make it bigger, combine using not only, but also. In winter, the days are short. They are also cold and dark. So I choose Nelson. Nelson, tell me, um, how do you do this? Combine using not only, but also. Can you rewrite this sentence? Can you repeat this sentence using not only but also, Nelson? The, the winter, the day are sure. They okay. are also, oh, no. You need to use the, not only. Uh, in, uh, I uh -huh. think, yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. I we in winter not only the day are short, they are also uh, but also cool and dark. But also cold and dark. Very good. Let's see. In winter the days are not only short, but also cold and dark. This is another way. That's right. And so on. Okay, Nelson, your turn. Select someone, okay, and then some continues. Okay, uh, next is Gabriela, combine not only, but also I send him many letters. I also try to telephone him. Gabriela? Okay, I send him not only many letters, but also try to telephone him. Huh. But also try to telephone him. Let's see. I not only send him many letters. Let's see, this is in past, yeah. But also try to telephone him. Yeah, basically it's the same thing you said. Mm -hmm. I send him not only many letters, yeah. But also try to telephone him. Good job. Okay. okay. Un gringo hubiese dicho phone con D al final. I also, but also phoned him, but also phoned him. Okay, teacher, <laughs> thank you, I get it. So that was good, okay, now you continue. Someone share the screen if possible. 
and you go one by one. Okay, you got it? Si saben que le dan, le dan F11 al browser, ¿verdad? Y si maximiza la pantalla, right? Yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, it's here. Okay, we are so quiet, too quiet. Let's see. Este es el punto de la dinámica, vamos a ver. Estamos trabajando por separado. Qué egoístas, come no, on. No, 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 llegamos a ese acuerdo. Ah, come on. Let's see, Adriana. Mm, let's see, combine. Using either or, or, neither nor. Ok. Hay que combinar las dos oraciones usando eso, cualquiera de esas dos. So, he will not come here. He will not send a representative. Un representante. He will not come here. He will not send a representative. Hmm. Anybody? Okay, so we give up. We give up. Okay. Now, both are negative. Both sentences are negative. So let's see who he will neither. He's neither. Mm -hmm. Neither, neither, right? So but he, I, I don't remember the neither begin in the at the beginning. Sentence. No. At the beginning? No. no, but this is he will not come. He, he will. will let's see. He come will. neither here or nor. Not nor. Uh -huh. No, no, nor. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, nor will not send a representative. Uh huh. Now, since I'm already neglecting, estoy negando, I don't need that anymore. Let's see. He no. will neither come here nor send a representative. Ya no necesito usar el auxiliar. Ah. Oh. Sí, porque ya lo ocupé una vez ya. Esto, eso prácticamente convierte todo en una sola oración. Uh -huh. Ya no soy repetitivo, ya no ocupo el come. Otra vez, o sea, como se ha pasado en otras oraciones. So, good. Y como decía la, la regla, continúo con el siguiente verbo. Después de eh, el per conjunction. Después del, del conector pareja, digamos. Nor, center representative. Ok. And so on. Ya tendrían que haberse los acabado. No sé si al, al darle ok se borran todos de nuevo. I don't know. Saca sí, un porcentaje van, arriba. Se van eliminando. Ajá, se van, se van quitando, ajá, y te va saliendo como... Está chido. Ok. Sí, ok. Está Muy bueno. Buena. 
<laughs> this is a good one. Okay, now you continue. I'll give you five minutes because everybody's like, they want to finish. So continue, okay? Okay, teacher. His son, his friend, he thought that both were lying. Either his son or his friend. His father believed either the son or his friend. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's either or. Neither nor, yeah. Either or. His father believed neither his son nor his friend. He turned up both for one. He doesn't believe both. Mm -hmm. Okay. Both. Okay. Susie, your turn. Okay. He will not come here. He will not send a representative. Mm -hmm. Maybe he will not. No, he will. Um, give me a second. I am confused. I don't remember when he used the not. If I supreme the not will yes. or come. Um, no, he will or him. He he either not come here or not send a representative. Mira, 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 mira. Oh, maybe he he will not he be there. He neither will come here. Uh, he neither will not come here. Neither he will not come here. Nor send. Nor he. Nor, not send a representative. Nor send a representative. Uh huh. Nor send a representative. I, I think for me it sounds better in that way. He will neither come oh, here nor no. send a representative. We are we are learning, we are learning. <laughs> Thank you. Él tampoco vendrá y no enviará un representante. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes, because when we use neither, we omit the other negative. Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, yes. Uh -huh. Yes, Pamela, your turn. Okay. Um, combine using either or nor, nor. Okay, either or, or neither nor. Ah, neither nor. Uh, he wasn't wearing a shirt. He wasn't wearing a coat. Um, neither he wasn't wearing a shirt nor um, a coat. Or maybe he neither was wearing a chair nor was wearing a coat. I am confused with the wasn't because he's negative. He wasn't wearing mm -hmm. either uh, a shirt. Because in this case, the... Substituimos, wasn't. Basta. Upset. 
Y la cosa es no. que, perdón. No le digas. She was hungry. She was. Ok. Profe, tengo una, una pregunta, disculpe en español. Yep. Fíjese que cuando yo aquí vaya, aquí está la respuesta correcta, ¿verdad? Esta es la respuesta correcta, ¿verdad? She was not only used, but also hungry. Hungry. Yes. She was not only upset, but also angry. Uh -huh. Va, pero si yo le doy aquí, cualquiera está, va, aquí no me puedo salir. Ah, para... no, es que le tiene que dar ok. Si sí está ah, correcta pues... la respuesta. Ajá, Ajá va a decir, le doy ok, va, pero me cambia todo. ¿ve? Lo que pasa es que elimina esa tarjeta hasta que se acaban todas. Y a ah. la izquierda, a la izquierda llevan un porcentaje. Es un juego. ¿eh? ¿A dónde uh -huh. va? Quiero ver a la izquierda. A la izquierda, ¿A la izquierda arriba. Walter, ahí está. ¿Esto? No, 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 la línea azul. ¿Aquí? A ver. Ah, ya, 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 ya. Ajá. Y dice, lo, y dice que, ah, ok. Entonces ahí, ahí va el porcentaje como van, han fallado una, han develado ah, tres, ajá, ah, okay. Do, y dos le han dado que han tenido correctas. So. <ríe> ah, va. Ahora, algo que pueden hacer es darle F11, quien está proyectando, compartiendo la imagen. Yo, yo, que le, F11 dice. Ajá. A ver si me lo acepta como cada teclado diferente. ¿En algún lugar o en, en nada? No, solo en la pantalla. Sí, solo ahí en la, en, en, en la, en la ventana que está compartiendo. Si es una laptop, sería función F11. Cinco años no le Ajá, es una laptop. Pero no logro ver a dónde tiene. Ah, F11, pero ahí lo que me dice, inicio. <risa> ah, no, no, no. Bueno, no. Ajá, tendría que decir FN y, y, y 11. Si puede, cierra esa ventanita al, en la parte de abajo. Para que ¿Cuál está? Ajá, cabal, ahí. Ahí está. Ok, tengo. Chivo. Ok, continue, my. Continue. My moon can and react right. She is. He lived. And the use is a. Either on, neither no. Ok. Let's check now from the next. Either came nor color called. What about this news? My mom can hear neither. Neither. Neither or why. Yeah. Let's check. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Neither read. No, right. Okay. 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 All right. 
you return tomorrow, you can start by counter policy. Either. 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 Okay. Company using my, he will not come here. He will not send a representative. Mm. 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 He is not a representative. He will not either conquer. He will either or or he. It's a neither. 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 But but the structure could be no. he will he he will need neither. He will neither come here nor send a representative. Okay. He will need it. He will need it. No se pierde la estructura, va siempre va el will después del sujeto. Mm -hmm. He will neither come here nor send a representative. Okay. In the next, I send him many letters. I also, I not only, I not only send him many letters, but I I you. But, but I also try to. But I also try to tell you something. I not only send him many letters. Okay. I said, like, in winter, not only the day oh, are yeah. short, it's a they are also he keeps the change answer. No, 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 don't worry. No se preocupe que Susana está justo a tiempo. Está ahí interesante lo que estamos haciendo y ya lo vamos a hacer como esperaba yo que, que lo hicieran. Si todo el mundo está que no, 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 no es eso. Sí, sí, es eso. no, no es así. So let's see. Okay, okay, okay. 11, 10, 9, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's see. So let me just go ahead and choose someone from our audience today. I'm not gonna show the video panel, let's see. Solo para futuros ejercicios como este. Hay que tratar de ser la, eh, lo más eh, creativo siempre y pensar de qué manera puedo yo ayudar a que esto sea más dinámico. Ok, pues comparto la, la pantalla. Si estoy desde una computadora, comparto la pantalla y empiezo a molestar a mis compañeros. Ok, let's see. Um, y le digo, Gloria. Number one, combine using either or, or neither nor. And these are the sentences. He did not come, he did not call. Okay, le doy tiempo a la compañera de que conteste. Digamos que no me contesta. Okay, um, someone else? Eso era lo que esperaban en los grupitos. Está viendo esa, 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 esa dinámica de todo, ese dinamismo de todos. Let's see. Susana. Oh, Ana, Ana, send me. Go, go. He neither came nor eh, nor called. Cold. Uh -huh. Cold. So he. Okay, so Ana, send me says he neither. Okay. Neither came. He neither came in past, okay. Nor cold. He neither teacher, came nor cold. That that's it, an Anselmi's option. It's uh -huh. possible to use either or and maintain the the negative, the auxiliary, or only is possible one answer. Or is it only, is it only possible one answer? To have one answer, um, let's see. Let's try it. That's the whole point. He, 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 either, he either didn't, didn't come, come or, or he didn't call. He did not call. He didn't call. Or, or didn't call. Mm -hmm. He's right. Yeah, yo lo he escuchado ahora. ¿Qué es gramaticalmente correcto y qué es gramaticalmente incorrecto, no? Gramática. ¿Es negativa la oración utilizar el neither o nor? Correct. Use sentido? neither, neither nor when it is a negative sentence and it, and it is done the way you did it. So let's see. Look. That's the best way. Yeah, we complete with the group. <laughs> <laughs> you complete it. Yeah. You complete. completed it. Miren, tengan cuidado con esto. Porque yo lo veo en el call center. A los bichos que están tomando llamadas. Como dejan notas, vea. Se pone. We completed. With the group. Por ejemplo, lo que acaba de decir. Uh -huh. We completed with the group. Y no ponen el it. Y eso es un problema de, de fonética. Porque tú lo pasas a pasado. Y dices, we completed it. We completed it. It. Y si yo también escribiera el it, okay, <laughs> entonces se queda mal la oración. We completed it uh -huh, with the group. We it's completed complete. it with the group. Okay, good. So that was good. Now, Susana, let's see. When I go to the restaurant, I eat fish, roast chicken. These are my favorite meals. You can use either or or neither nor. Okay. When I go to the restaurant, I eat either fish bueno, si te or chicken. These are my favorite meals. <laughs> Good. These, these are my favorite meals. Yeah, simple. That's simpler. This is más fácil, más simple. Okay, and either or, because you have two options, right? <laughs> you only have two options. When I go to the restaurant, when I go to the restaurant, eat either fish or roast chicken. These are my favorite meals. Mira, 
Okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go with the next one. Sandra, would you like to try, Sandra? Hi. Okay, try. Charlie, uh, Bill, we'll write a report. Just ask one of them. Charlie, Bill will write the report. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Uh, neither, neither Charlie nor Bill will write the report. Just ask one on them. One of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're we're given two options, right? Mm. Just neither? ask one of them. Neither is for a negative sentence. So is this a negative sentence? Positive sentence. It's a positive sentence, right? So it should be options. Try it again, try it again. It goes here. Okay. Either, either, either. Charlie. Charlie or or we will write the report. The report. The report. 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 Mm -hmm. The report. Just. Just. Ask. 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 <laughs> Cuesta al revés, vea. Ask, 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 no. Ask. 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 Mm -hmm. One of them. One of them. One of them. Mm -hmm. So exactly. Either Charlie or Bill write the report. Just ask one of them. Hay errores en esta en esta en esta paginita si ya se fijaron, verdad? ¿Qué falta en esta oración? Ask. Ask. Is it yes? will write a report the the auxiliary is missing either charlie or bill will write the report just ask one of them okay and so on and y el punto era que a medida que ustedes fuesen avanzando se van eliminando las 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 cajitas ¿sí? hasta llegar a cero y poder ver el reporte vuelvan a hacer en su casa les invito a que dediquen tiempo a esto y lo vuelvan a hacer por su propia cuenta Aquí va el, el porcentaje. ¿eh? Sí, y sean sinceros, si se equivocan en alguna, denle la X. ¿sí? Para no mentirse ustedes mismos, para ver qué tanto han comprendido. ¿Ok? ¿Bien? Ok. Ok, let's do the attendance one more time. Ada Patricia Nidales Galdames. Here. Thank you. Adriana Stephanie Martínez Flores. Present. Ana Selmi Chévez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Okay. Flor de Maria Carballo Ugarte. Present. Thank you. Gabriela Ignacio. I'm sorry. Gabriel Ignacio Lara. Present. Thank you, Gabriel. Sorry. Gabriela Alejandra González Flores. Present. Thank you. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Here. Thank you. Julia Patricia Vasquez Santos. Julia is not here again. Carla Verónica Vasquez de Rivas. Present teacher. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Present teacher. Thank you. Ofelia Orellana Arce. Here teacher. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Good evening, present. Thank you. Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Present. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Present. Stephanie Elizabeth Ayala Pérez. Present. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present, teacher. Thank you. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Thank you. Ven, vamos a hacer un juego súper rápido. Necesito que se vayan a su chat de acá de Zoom y me escriban un nombre de negocio que si ustedes estuviesen 
10 mil dólares ahorita en el bolsillo. ¿Qué tipo de negocio salvadoreño pondrían? Small and medium business. Una pyme. Algo pequeño. 10 mil dólares no es mucho. Entonces somos adolescentes acá. No, más específico. Bien específico, Sandra. Algo que tenga que ver con turismo. ¿Qué? ¿Qué de turismo? Traveling aún más específico, Sandra. Ya va llegando, ya va llegando. ¿Quién se encarga de los turistas, Sandra, cuando vienen? There's a name. The agencies. Ah, oh, a travel agency? Hmm. Vamos, chicos. Usen su imaginación. Ahorita los necesito muy, creativo, muy creativos. Production of chocolate. Ok, tenemos una. Mm, producción de chocolate. Ok. Yeah. And sell me. Organic. Es, es el negocio, eh. Ojo, es un negocio. Entonces, ¿qué yes. negocio? Voy a producir chocolate. Ok. Chocolate, chocolate production, ok. Typical food, Stephanie, be more specific. What are you going to do? Are you going to sell pupusas and tamales and all that? Ok, so then you say, Sandra, travel agency. Ok, travel agency. Custom made suits. Custom made suits. Mm, like Salvadorian suits, Pamela? What's on your mind? Uh-huh, good, Sandra, I see. So I have surf, surf classes, okay. Gabriel says surf classes. Let me see how many I have. I have 19 students, let's say five per group, so we will have four groups, okay. So let's say number one will be chocolate production, okay? Chocolate production. Okay. Chocolate production. A chocolate factory, let's say. Number two, we have uh, typical food, typical food. A travel agency, Sandra said. Think about a name, a name for these businesses. Custom made suits. I like your idea, Pamela, but be more specific. Is it for Salvadorian suits or? Mm. Hmm. I don't know. Custom suits. Custom suits. I like the idea. We have to develop it a little bit more. Okay, at this point, you have to start thinking as a company, a floor, a gym, a gym, where? Tour guide, okay, a tour guide, Ada. Is, isn't it among the travel agency? I like that, tour guide. Surf classes, I like the idea of the surf classes because it goes all in one package. If you go to surf city, by the way, you say surf. Don't say surf, okay? No, surf, you say surf, surf, surf. Let's go surfing, surfing, tour guide. Okay, we'll start a construction company, a construction company, uh, like like building houses, Wilfredo? Pupuseria Mateos. <laughs> yes, yes, teacher, I, I like it because, um... And four years ago, I, I, I built my, my house. Well, I, I not, but, but I, I... You hired someone. Yes. Mm -hmm. I hired a friend, but he is a... Architect? Um, a, no, but it is, he is um, Albanian. How do you say it? The, the, brick the brick builder. A brick builder. Uh, brick? Brick builder. Uh, okay. That's a, that's a way to then say it. Uh -huh. I... I knew, uh, I, I know, the, the past of no. I knew? 
I, I knew uh, another friend that he is an electrician. An electrician, okay. Uh, an electrician. Then I I had to learn to make a, a, a build up or a budget to, to, to build my house. Then in the, um, for um, two months ago, I continue um, making another another rooms in my house. But a friend told me if I I I know uh, um, will you will you write this word, teacher, to to talk about Albanil? Mason. It's actually a mason. I said brick layer, brick, brick builder. It's actually mason. M-A-S-O-N. Mason. Mason. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. But mm, my, my friend told me that he wants to, to um, um, build or remodelar. Improve? Or make, improve? Improve, improve the... Uh, his house to and make a some um, apartment to rent to, for example, to the student because we we live near to the national university. But I told him, hey, I I have a friend. I, I told him that we can help you. Or hmm. We can do it. Yeah, that, that you could do it. Yes, you know that that's a good way. Okay, so I'm gonna stay with six. Now you have to eliminate two of them. I have a chocolate factory. I have a travel agency, which is the same as a tour guide, surf classes, all of that, it goes on the travel agency. Then we have custom suits. Pamela's idea, I like, like the idea, but we have to develop it a little bit. Custom suits. I put a custom made tailor suit. Yeah, I, I got your idea. Oh, I got your point. A tailor, a tailor for, but that's for gentlemen, right? A tailor. And not only. Not uh, only for tailor, No, tailor is about women and, and men. Women and men. Women and men. Mm -hmm. yeah. hmm. But that's more like Italian, you know, because they, they have access to all the clothes. I don't know. But I like the idea, but I don't know. Guatemalan suits are more famous than Salvadorian suits, don't you think? I mean, Guatemala has their fashion, don't you think? Yeah, here it's because they have fabrics. Here we don't have it. We don't have fabrics, that's right. Yeah. Are you saying factories or, or fabric, the clothes? <laughs> the clothes for- The cloth, uh, they have the, yeah. their typical fabrics, it's true. Yes. It's true, true, true. Okay, mm, so maybe, okay, let's take custom suits off. What about the gym? What do you think about the gym? Uh, digital. Huh? <laughs> gym digital. Oh, uh, a vegan, a vegan, vegan gym. Okay. <laughs> gym vegetariano. <laughs> That's crazy. Big and gym. No, okay. A digital. Um, a digital gym? Yes. An online gym. Online. Online. Online, online. online gym. Oh my God. For women. <laughs> For women. Really? Women. Teacher. Yes. Oh. This is a good idea. I remember in the quarantine with my my <laughs> children, uh, we we made, made some, uh, a lot of exercise. But we with, with watching, these guys from TV watching videos, but no, oh, way, but, no, but really. Videos, but then I I start to show people that they they start to work and making exercise about online. And online, true. Do you know what? Now that you, you mentioned this, guys, I remember during the quarantine, um, there was a program on channel 21, I think, or channel seven with El Turron. The guys from EXA, they started doing like exercises, you know, and they used to, you, you could send them a short video of you watching them and doing the exercises at home. Do you remember? It was crazy. I mean, the kids used to go like, 
man, it's just that that was so sad. Everybody was inside their houses. And, oh, wow. Good memories. Wow. Okay. So what do we have so far? Chocolate factory, a travel agency, a gym, a pupuseria, and an event planner. I like the idea of an event planner. Now, first question, what do all these businesses have in common? What is there in common in all of these businesses? Think. What is something that is always present in any business? There are ideas of the business. There mm. are for entrepreneurs? No. There are ideas of the business. Like yes, in general, there are ideas of the business and the uh, there are the projects of entrepreneurs. Entrepreneur projects of all these businesses. Yeah. Do we have yet yeah, chocolate factory? You know, on Friday I was coming from Lourdes, coming back from Lourdes. And I saw an old lady selling chocolate, you know, like handmade chocolate, um, artisanal, artisanal chocolate in a, in a corner. And I bought some chocolate from her. And it was, was okay. That's an entrepreneurship. That's an entrepreneurship. But when you talk about it, Chocolate factory with ten thousand dollars. Oh, let's remember that. If you have ten thousand dollars, there, there is a value add. An actual value, an actual value of the of the business. Yes, the the idea is different. It is a different idea, but investing $10,000 on a chocolate factory, is it the same as investing $10,000 on a travel agency with tour guides and surf classes? Depends. It depends on what? Everybody, <laughs> come on, Susana. Adriana? A este punto necesito que empiecen a ser muy creativos, porque la manera en la que se desarrolla el avanzado uno es que ustedes empiezan desde ahorita, agarran una idea de una empresa, una pyme, ¿sí? Y empiezan a desarrollar la idea desde adentro hacia afuera. Y a veces vamos a regresar adentro otra vez. Vamos a ver costos, vamos a ver uh, retorno de inversión segura, ¿right? Son, son temas que si no llevamos a cabo este ejercicio, y lo volvemos algo como muy creativo, que le en el gusto. Después se me van a aburrir, van a decir, ay, es que no estoy entendiendo nada. Pero si tú, y eso ya me pasó, le di la idea a alguien en el, hace varios años, y le gustó tanto la idea que le implementaron. Hicieron pizza de huevo. <risa> really? That's a crazy idea. That's a crazy idea. Delicious, yeah. <risa> y solo un cuento breve. Aquí este panzón que me participaron, participó en, um, en la creación de esta de la telepisa. ¿Ya? Yeah. So we tried. Eso fue un proyecto, sí. Vamos a pensar en esa historia. ¿Cómo fue que se creó todas las pruebas? ¿Sabes? Probar chicharrón en una pizza. No se pudo. Demasiada grasa. Demasiada grasa. Y por eso, y por eso quedó bien, súper bien la típica. Right? ¿Ya la han probado la típica de la telepisa? ¿No? Yes. Hey, <risa> frijoles molidos On bien Friday. refritos. Oh my God. Ajá. Uh -huh. Este really? chorizo, queso con loroco. Bacon. Ajá, bacon y salchicha. O sea, oh, todo como bien típico. Y lo, lo, con loroco, o sea, wow. He quedado súper bien. Súper bien. Pero sí, el, el tocino fue un fracaso. ¿Cómo es el, la, el chicharrón? Azarura me dio, fue un fracaso. 
se traspasaba por la por el por el pan. It's part of the project, teacher. Yeah, it's too much. Okay, so that's the idea. An idea will give you money eventually. So think you have ten thousand dollars. What is there in common among all of these companies, all of these entrepreneurships? Whatever you want to call company, it. the seed capital. The same capital. The seed. No. Strategy, teacher. Strategy. Capital. Repeat. Strategy. Strategy. Good. Strategy. Seed capital. Okay. Seed capital. Seed capital. Mm. Come on. There's always something in common in every company. It doesn't matter what it is. If there are humans working in that company, well, not even if, even if there are no humans, there's something always in, in every company. And that is the pillar. That's the main thing in every company. Right. Come on. You give up? Do you want a clue? You need a clue? A clue, please. <laughs> okay. That's the acronym. That is the acronym. I don't know that companies are related to services. <laughs> no, but even if they produce, Gabriel, they must have, Gabriel. Um, uh, what is the acronym in the capital social? No. Oh no, <laughs> customer service. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> my mind financial mind. Now mind this, remember, mind this. Customer service. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mind this. Mind um it. sometimes we will need to think as owners of the company, sometimes we will need to think as customers. And listen to this, if you, if first God, you know, if you ever have a company of your own, don't forget, never forget to have empathy, okay? Have empathy. And if th there is a problem, think first as a customer, okay? If there is a problem with your employee and you you need to think in both ways as the employee and as the company. There are always two sides of the story, right? There there is a, a tool teacher, the analysis of empathy. And you analyze the different uh, stakeholders mm -hmm. related to the business. That's right, the stakeholders, I love that word. So we will see a lot of uh, vocabulary starting in this module, um, but you, you have to find a balance between feeling as a customer and feeling as a business owner. Uh, the example of an employee, the employee is stealing money. What will you do? Would you let him go? No? Would you let him go? If I have proofs that he's stolen me? No, you have proofs. Okay. I, let's say I, let's say he's stolen a hundred dollars from the register. Hmm. Is five, 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 fire, fire him? Yeah, I fire him. What do you think, Flor? The pen of the situation, teacher. In my Fine. case, I feel it is possible to give the other opportunity. Give another chance, to give him another yes. chance. But depends because maybe it's possible that specific situation um, 
But... Forced that in a specific situation forced this human being forced to human steal being. money. Yes. But, but it's not right. It's, it's not okay. Important, it's important to have the specific policy about. Nah, even if you have policies as a manager, you have to. Yes, but. Be empathetic once. Once. Only. Once. One. But that once, uh, Naselmi, means that you know the person. And of course, if you hired, if you hired that person, you know that person. Then you go like, wait a minute, this guy has never stolen money. So you call him, right? Hey, why did you steal the hundred dollars? Oh, because my daughter is sick, you know, and I needed the money. And you knew, you knew that he had a problem. Okay different story i don't know this person i didn't hire him okay Anna said me come here you interviewed roberto he's stolen a hundred dollars what do we do mm -hmm. do you trust him do you trust him and you go like oh yeah yeah it's not like that i mean i can i promise you that's not the way he is okay let's give him another chance and so on right okay but yes, customer service, it goes outside and inside your company. And that's just one example of a possible training. What kind of training do you need to provide to your employees regarding customer service? Um, I love this, this one. Um, it's called people skills. And we go back to El Seguro Social, ladies and gentlemen people skills that's a major skill okay a major skill that is a human being if you have it you're the best thing okay so people skills do you think that someone manufacturing chocolate will need to know about people skills yes teacher yeah okay anna says yes adriana is nodding why <laughs> Come on, tell me what. Tell, tell me what. Susana, Susana. All people need skills. People skills. skills. People skills. But why? I mean, you're manufacturing chocolate. But he, because you because need, he you need to learn. You need, you need guide. You need. I don't know in English. How to treat others. If if he or she are the boss, he needs to communicate. He needs to to ah. find the way to inter interact interact. I don't know. Interact. Yes, interact. good interact. Yeah, interact with the employees. And with future what clients, right? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, same question. Does anybody in a pupuseria need people skills? Yes, teacher. Yes. yes. <laughs> we go back to the same question of, of La Tiendita. I told you, right? ¿Qué quiere? Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> no se fía. ¿Qué quiere? Well, okay. Yeah, Jim. Sería an event planner without people skills. Can you imagine that, Carla? No way. <laughs> no. Oh my God, Carla. You hire me. You tell me, teacher, I need you to prepare my birthday party. ¿Y qué va a querer en la fiesta de cumpleaños? My God. Right? <laughs> <It's> like... lago. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> And so on, an online gym, people skills. Now, this is tricky. This is a little bit weird, but you're online. Can you imagine if I didn't have people skills? Vamos a la página 10. Por favor, ni en inglés les hablaría. Página 10 de su libro. No hay nada. Lea bien, por favor, señora. Ahí está todo. Vaya, lo voy a dividir en grupos ahora. 
Okay, let's go. Oh my God, no, right? So you got the idea. Now we made six groups. How are we going to do this? We people have techniques to make things. I like that. People have techniques to make things. Happen. Le faltó el happen ahí. <laughs> People have techniques to make things happen. True. Hay un libro de hecho que se llama Cómo convencer a otros para que hagan lo que tú quieras. Algo así se llamaba. The Carnegie Carnegie College. Yeah, this is the Carnegie Hall. Um, Ah, lo voy a buscar. Y, y, how to convince others, creo que se llamaba algo así. Pero era interesantísimo. Ok, uh, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Tenemos que dividirnos en grupos, seleccionar un negocio. Ok, y eso es lo difícil. Que va a ser el que les... Um, el que les toque. ¿eh? So, a ver. Tenemos seis grupos. So, voy a decir los nombres nada más. Ahorita los voy a crear. Solo podemos tener cinco grupos máximo. Van a haber de cuatro, de tres a cuatro participantes en los grupos. So, let's do it. Let's go. Ok. Ay, perdón. No se unan. No se unan. No se unan. No se unan. Se unieron. <risa> Oh my God, para que le di clic al botón. Seguir instrucciones. Yeah. No le culpa. My bad. Ya les voy a les voy a poner la canción. Come back, baby, come back. The joke. Ok, good. Y mis personas estoy esperando. Oh my God, Pamela se fue. No, no, aquí está Pamela y Sandra. Y Carla no han regresado. Ophelia también. How to win friends and influence people. Cómo ganar personas e influenciar Cómo, es, cómo ganar amigos e, e influenciar en las personas. Así se llama el libro. That's another thing. Ok. Good. So we're back. Voy a recrear los grupos. Y eh, perdón, fue mi error. So, grupo número uno. Carla Vázquez, Ofelia, Pamela y Wilfredo. Repito, Carla, Ofelia, Pamela y Wilfredo. Ok. Grupo número dos. Flor de María, Wendy, Susana, Walter. Susana Carolina, right? Grupo número tres, Adriana Martínez, Gabriel, Ignacio, Gabriela y Nelson. Siempre quedan juntos Gabriel y Gabriela. <ríe> ok. Número cuatro, Ada Patricia, Gloria Elizabeth, Pamela y Stephanie. Y el 5, Ana Selmi, Roselena y Sandra. So, necesito que me elijan un, um, una empresa con la que van a estar trabajando. Un rubro u empresa, o empresa. Vamos a ver, Carla, ¿qué sería en su grupo? Carla, Ofelia, Pamela y Wilfredo. Eso de las que enlistamos, teacher. O lo digo yo, así, de la 1 a la 5. A la Por ejemplo, 
ah, pero no querría hacer mi, que alguien más tome la idea del chocolate, supongo. Toma no, sí. ¿Sí? Es para propósitos didácticos. Sí, porque sería el grupo uno sería el Chocolate Factory. Ok, va. So, group number one, Chocolate Factory. Number two, Travel Agency. Y ahí está Floro, Wendy, Susana y Walter, the Travel Agency. Ok, el número tres, Adriana, Gabriel, Gabriela y Nelson, el gym, el online gym, ok. Número cuatro, la pupusería, le tocó a, a la Patricia, Gloria, Pamela y Stephanie. No crean, hay de dónde darse gusto si son muy creativos. Hasta en línea se puede tener la pupusería, señores. <risa> Ok. Y al grupo número 5, que es de Ana Selmi, Roselena y Sandra, uh, eh, les tocó, eh, ya sea Event Planner. Sí, ¿verdad? E event Planner. Tengo dos veces el gym. Ajá, uh -huh. sería el Event Planner. Ah, ¿se, se pueden echar una película que se trata de eso, que es de mujeres. Guerra de. ¿Cómo es que se llamó? Creo que guerra de novia, no me acuerdo. Una película femenina sobre eso. Ok. Good. So, les voy a dividir un par de minutos para que se pongan de acuerdo. ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer? Todo orientado a, primero que nada, qué necesidades de entrenamiento tendría dentro de, de la empresa que voy a crear. ¿Sí? Porque esto es algo que alguien que funda una empresa o se vuelve entrepreneur de la noche a la mañana no se pone a pensar cuando ya adquiere personal capacitar o no al personal. Hmm. Sí, algo crítico, algo muy necesario. Anyways, let's go. Vamos a tener solo 12 minutos, 12, 15 minutos para poder planear juntos qué vamos a hacer, qué tipo de, de entrenamientos le daríamos al personal. Si tenemos 10 mil dólares, ¿cuántas personas vamos a tener? ¿Ok? ¿Y qué sería lo primero que les vamos a enseñar? Lo segundo y lo tercero. ¿Ok? You got it? Pero de un espacio para que nos apuremos. Ok, let's go. Pamela. Yo sé de eso. Um, okay. Uh, we have a chocolate chocolate factory. factory. Um, okay. For me, the first training for the personnel is food handling because it's the base to the personnel in handling the 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 process for the for... Firma, yes uh, the the people had to to receive uh, the all the training about um honey chocolate yes. or how they have to prepare for um, uh, receipt to do it yes then... the full handling is the principal training that is re uh, requested by helping um, Ministerio de Salud, ¿cómo se dice? Ministerio de Salud. Ministerio de Salud en El Salvador. Uh -huh. is, the, is the first training. For the first one could be full handling. 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 Mm -hmm. 
from the, the first training, mm -hmm. the first. Kobe, uh, really full. Yeah. Yes. Um, okay. After that, we 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 need to know how many people we are going to need to start the mm -hmm. the business. Is um okay. The the business is a, a small business because only yeah. have ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars. Yes, but for I, for me, okay. I need only one person in a customer service, and more plus then I, I don't know if uh oh. Oh, no, 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 no. It's a factory. Okay. Uh, I I think that another person to, to factor it in the factory. Because it's a, it's a small business. To produce. Ah, yeah, to produce. Thank you. To produce or to manipulate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Thank you. Uh, teacher, a question. I have mm -hmm. uh, you put me in two groups. I know. <laughs> <laughs> and what is I supposed to be? Wait, wait. Um, you're supposed to be in this one, I think. Number mm -hmm. one. Oh, yeah, when you say my name, you say me wrong. Amela four. is in the first group. I said four. I said four, right, Pame? Yeah. Okay. You told me. You told me room four. Okay, I'm moving you right now. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Oops. And it's so difficult. Let's see. Yeah, Pamela shouldn't be here. Okay, keep going. Okay. And, and Wilfredo? Um, uh, I guess, I guess, Carla, that we, we need to, we need to hire a, a, a person to man, man, manipulate uh, for example, or, or handle a, a machine. Yes. Yes, because uh, I, I, I don't know. I think that with ten thousand dollars, uh, I don't know. It's correct diplomatic. Uh, I don't know. When you know the the restriction or requirement. Requisitos, maybe the, the requirements and requirement the other countries. Of, from, Teacher, how do you say actualization? Update. Update. Up the update. Update. Win Windows update. Mm. Is destination update? Destiny no. Wait, you, you are doing the, uh, what? Federal agency, right? In the, this so is, he's no there. Easy. <laughs> yes, when the people know their, only a restriction in, if you don't have a set, come say it. Like like traditions like the customs. In, no, the, the know the knowledge of the traditions maybe. When people oh oh you mean yeah the culture the culture of the country mm -hmm. so you're okay. planning you're, are you planning to train your employees first on cultural knowledge cultural knowledge. Yes, so, we make we we make the list of a training we need for employees. Mm -hmm. I got you. That's a good idea. 
among among those touristic touristic places, right? Mm -hmm. But we have a, a little question. Main uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, the we, what what is the company uh, for the group for for our groups? Your group is number four, so group number four, even planner. Okay. Even planner. Okay. Sí, okay. la dulcería, o sea, no, no, no. no, usted no dijo pupusería al principio. Really? Yes. No, that's group number three. Hold on. <laughs> Gabriela, Adriana, Gabriel y Nelson llevan la pupusería. Really? Pregunta. Ah, sí, porque yo les dije Jim a ellos. Ya vuelvo, ya vuelvo. Okay. Ya nos hicimos bola, pero. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. Déjenme hablar con ellos. Hello. Chicos, ¿están preparando para un gym o para una pupusería? It's a gym. Gym. A gym. A gym. Yes. Okay. Good. Thank you. Pupusería. No. Pupusería, no. Un gimnasio que de tu mamá para adelgazar, dice, vaya. Yes. <laughs> Salud. Ok, están preparando una, eh, perdón, un gym ellos. El grupo 3 está con un gym. <risa> so, ustedes podrían tomar la pupusería okay. si quieren o yeah. el event planner. Ay, se le fue la señora Pamela. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, what? <laughs> que te cortaste? No, sé qué no. <laughs> no, I not, I didn't say nothing about it. You didn't say anything. <laughs> I, I didn't know. say anything about it. Okay. <laughs> so what what is it? Pupuseria or or even planning? Oh. I, to me it's cool be what uh everyone. I don't know uh, what do you what do you want? What do you want, Ada, Gloria? What do you prefer, event planning or pupusería? <laughs> what kind of this, what kind of saying? It's not the same. <laughs> it's planning an event. Kind of company. Or company. Lo que sea, whatever. It doesn't matter what kind of company okay. you, you choose. Okay. Mm -hmm. Love you. But tell me. Um, it's a, what is it? Even in, Even planner or pupuseria? Planner. Even planner? Okay. 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 There we go. Okay. So that, that's going to be the order. Okay. Bye. I'll okay. be right back. Thank you. Um, uh, even, even planner for everything. <laughs> yeah, for everything. What's the yeah. están haciendo even planner? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> why teacher? Why, why teacher? the expression, why? teacher? Ah, why teacher? Porque teníamos dos veces gym. Uh -huh. Ah, ah, yes. but but the uh, topic even planning. Va, okay. Uh -huh. Yes, teacher, you say even planner. Pero eran seis. There are Eran seis things. temas, pero en realidad Jim estaba repetido dos veces. So. Exactly. Yeah. Um, at the last. Nope. No, I'll have to go back with Gloria and Ada. Gloria and Ada, pupusería, teacher. I know, I know. <laughs> okay, I'll go back with them. Keep going, keep going. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. We have our list. Creating thinking. Don't um, hate. Don't hate me. Hmm? Don't we hate. We change me. again. <laughs> I'm sorry. El, el grupo 5 está preparando event planner. Pero si ustedes quieren seguir con eso, no importa que hayan dos event planner. La verdad es que sería algo interesante. A ver quién sale más creativo. But it, it's up to you. Se los dejo a su discreción lo que ustedes quieran hacer. ¿Ok? Ok. Así. Uh, Planeadores de eventos con pupusas. It's up to you. I don't know. Dios mío. Camila. Yeah. You already have the description, the event planet. And. Uh, it's okay. Uh huh. Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> Be creative. Be creative. That's all, okay? Let's have uh, a. Nothing. It's uh, for rent. Only online. Uh huh. Only online. Yeah, for the moment we can't uh, do online to yes, save the, the money. Yeah, to save the the money to arrange the local the place. Yes. Yes, low. for the service is possible. Low, lower, lower inversion. Yeah. A smaller, a smaller inversion. A smaller investment, investment, a smaller investment. Bajo, bajo inversion. Mm -hmm. Más bajo. Más pequeña. Smaller investment. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, right. There's less yes. risk, more risk. So how are you doing? What trainings are you going to implement first? Our list of the training is following. Self-control? Self-control? <laughs> planet, yes, teacher, because hmm. the each event how to organize yourself? Yes, why not? No, how to organize? No, how to control yourself? <laughs> yes, teacher. Mm. Yes, because yes. there, there will be a, 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 I don't know what can I say, a disaster. <laughs> no, there could be teacher, a disaster. Yeah, there could be a disaster. In, in this business, the client contract. Because uh, it's free, free stress <laughs> for the organization <laughs> of the event. Stress free. The stress is part of the business of the event plan. Being stressed all day is part of the business, yes. It's true. Yeah. That is true. It's very important, the self-control for the plan. Mm. Mm. Yes. The good communication, the other Training? Communication. Something that I, I, yeah. I was admired of when I got married is that we went to some event planners mm -hmm. and these people is so organized. Yes. Time management. Uh, they have timetables. Yeah. They have timetables. When yeah. someone is very organized, yeah. they have a schedule and agenda. And exactly. The, from the first they they tell you okay what we say today is going to be written in the calendar okay so we have okay. to re respect the mm -hmm. calendar so really strict yes. Yes, it's, very it's this other topic of training teacher good how to make chocolate with cacao okay <laughs> okay this this is going serious they're going serious. Almendras. Chocolate with almendras. <laughs> Almond chocolate. Oh my God. Lowe's chocolate. Oh my God. We're going <laughs> to 
end up fat on this group. Okay, we're almost done. Hurry up. <laughs> Not necessary, teacher. Not teacher. necessarily. It has a lot of benefit for the health. I know. Look at me. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. A lot of benefits for me. Okay. I know. I know. It's really good. But natural, natural chocolate. Yes, natural chocolate. Okay, let's uh, go. The other, the skill. Ojalá se pueda. Okay, other option. Hi, teacher. We are select many, many in trainings for, for the employees. Many trainings for yes. the employees. Yes. But in, in, in this case, uh, we have the basic or the more principle is customer service. Mm -hmm. It's the base, the, the business. The base of the business. Yeah, travel agency. Knowing other languages, maybe? Yes, we, yes. That we have in training for no other language, uh, organization of activities, um, knowledge of other cultures, uh, tourist place, um, training in negotiation capacity, capacity, sorry, and market knowledge and application. And, no, in the, the, the last one. Um, knowledge when use the apps. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good, good. We have to go, but we will talk about it together okay i hope you wrote everything okay yes Bye. Okay, time flies. Time goes by really fast. Can't remember who I was with. Last time I was with Gloria, I think. Um, Julia is not here. Carla Veronica Vasquez de Rivas. Not here yet. Okay, eh, super rápido. Nos queda un minuto antes de pasar el listado, espero que hayan tomado eh, notas de sus ideas poco a poco vamos a ir haciendo, quizás lo primero yo sé que ahorita surgieron muchas propuestas de training pero lo que sigue es eh, minimizar ese listado a, a, en un grado de, de, de importancia, ¿no? que es lo que se prioriza más por sobre otras cosas y esto, hay muchos factores involucrados en esa toma de decisiones, porque puede ser, si tenés 10 mil dólares, que trading puede ser que te vayas por el lado de los costos, que, que será más barato, que será más factible, ya, si darles customer service o dejarlos que sean agresivos en las ventas, o sea, todo eso lo tenés que tomar en cuenta a la hora de iniciar el negocio. So, vamos a ir hablando poco a poco de eso, ¿ok? Um, Carlita, do you have 10 minutes or was I with you last time? Estuvimos juntos la última vez, Carla, en los últimos 10 minutos. No, ¿verdad? Sí, era Julia quien le tocaba. Bueno, do you have 10 minutes for me? Yeah, yes. No yeah, yeah, it's okay. I don't want to. I don't want to, honestly, but yeah. Okay. Good. Good night, guys. Ada Patricia Linares Galdames. Present. Good night. Adrián Stephanie Martínez Flores. Present. Thank you. Ana Selmi Chévez. Present teacher. Night. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Flor de María Carballo Garte. Present. Good night. Good night. Gabriel Ignacio Lara. Present. Good night. Gabriel Alejandra González Flores. Present. Good night. Yep. Good night. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Good night. Good night. Julia Patricia Vázquez Santos. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. Present. <laughs> Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Nelson was there. Ofelia Orellana Arce. Thank you. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. 
present. Good night. Present teacher Nelson. <laughs> Thank you, Nelson. It's okay. Thank you the presentation. It's okay. Rosalina Salgado de Serrano. Present teacher. Sandra Gladys Mendez Ramirez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night, Stephanie. Elizabeth Ayala Pérez. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present teacher. Good night. And good night. And Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. See you. Good night. See you tomorrow, guys. See you tomorrow. See you, See you tomorrow. Thank Bye. You. Bye. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Thank you. Good class. Okay. They didn't want to leave. How are you? Are you sure we were not together last session? I don't remember. No, it's my first time with you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. So how are you? Tell me, how's the business? Oh, that's very good, teacher. And you? How are you? Your fourth day off. <laughs> what? My, oh, my four days off? Mm -hmm. I mean, off from the classes. I was okay. That was okay. The thing is that I'm too, I'm getting fatter. I'm getting too fat. So I'm becoming like lazier, you know. Like, I don't <laughs> want to do things. And it's not okay. That's not okay. No work during the four days. Yeah, I, I did work. Ah. I did work. But just the call center. Just the mornings. Okay. okay. In the call center is I, I imagine that uh don't have a day off. I do have a day off. Um it's Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, yeah, oh, basically. Okay. Yeah. Hol holiday. Uh, oh, yeah. We don't have holidays. That's right. We mm -hmm. don't have holidays on the call center. It's, it's very impossible because it's a customer service. And I imagine um, that all day. No, um, I actually work for prepaid cards. Like, uh, yeah. And I work on the uh, fraud reporting, you know, when somebody steals your money. Okay. from your car you call me and i go like oh, okay let's dispute let's dispute this and then we work with visa mastercard and all that okay. and we, re we recover the money but it's i'm not complicated it's legal legal processes but yeah. i'm not i'm not taking calls i'm not answering the phone i'm okay. just i'm just working here with the two monitors you know what looking uh, at documents, legal documents, all day. What what is the big case do you have seen during your experience in the course? Well, for the last two years, because I'm about to be two years in this call center tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow I will have two mm -hmm. years working here. Uh, do you mean the the biggest problem I have seen? Yeah, the fifteen fifteen thousand dollars. You know the the New York New York la alcaldía, <laughs> the township. They gave fifteen thousand fifteen thousand dollars to people without a job unemployed people so you applied and they gave you a card with fifteen thousand dollars and then some it's a, it's a corporate credit card or personal no no, no it's just prepaid Prepago. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. so you put a hundred dollars it's a gift card a gift. a gift card and i give it to carla okay carla here's a hundred dollars so let's see New York, they gave $15,000 to about 10,000 people. 
Okay, a hundred and fifty thousand dollars. And then a Salvadorian, right? Ah, me va a gastar este pisto y va a decir que me robaron la tarjeta. Pues sí, vea. Bad idea. No, no, they made it. They made it. They got the, a new card with the money and everything. And then, eh. and then this guy goes smart and he starts telling the neighbor, hey, mira, voy a llamar aquí, que te den el pisto de regreso, mira, le haces así. Pero hacete pasar por la víctima. Y ahí me hablaba la doña Teresita. Yo ahorita voy chequeando y no tengo nada en la tarjeta. Ya, yo no sé. No sé quién habrá agarrado. Yo no sé de esas cosas, vea. Y uno, ay, pobrecita la señora. Pero uh -huh. ustedes abren un caso de investigación y todo. So, pero el punto es que eventualmente, poco a poco, nos fuimos dando cuenta del chanchullo. ¿eh? ¿Cómo uh -huh. era que habían hecho eso? ¿Qué mañas se habían agarrado? ¿Cómo lo habían hecho? Entonces ya empezamos a poner más trabas. Si usted quiere denunciar fraude en su tarjeta, tiene que ir al, a la policía a reportar el fraude. Le van a dar un número de casos. Tiene que ir donde un notario a, a ponerle sello a ese formulario. Entonces ya la gente, más los latinos, va a ir donde un notario a ir a la policía. Me van a mandar de puerta. <risa> ya no voy mejor. En serio. Mejor me lo responsable. En serio, hablé con un señor y me dijo, mire, yo, hermano, yo no puedo ir a la policía porque a mí me mandan de regreso para allá, para mi pueblo. Y yo, ok. Eh, pobrecito, hubiera, claro, justos por pecadores siempre, pero eso son 15 mil dólares, Carlos. O sea, bueno, se quedaron con 30 algunos prácticamente, pues fue una gran vivianada realmente. Y sí, me dolió. Cuando yo me di cuenta fue como, oh, no, ¿qué hemos hecho? Hasta, mira, hasta usted le dolió el frente. Sí, eso fue como el chico ese que agarraron en una academia de inglés, se dio cuenta. ¿No? ¿No? El que lo, lo vino a traer a um, los Marshalls de Estados Unidos. El tipo era ex marín y todo, y estaba acá en El Salvador dando clases de inglés, bien chido y todo. Era salvadoreño, pero nacido allá, creo. La cosa es que se vino para México porque como que asesinó a la esposa o la dejó toda golpeada, salió yendo para México. De ahí le perdieron la pista. Y aquí estaba dando clases y ofrecían 50 mil dólares por él en la página de, de los Marshalls en Internet. Y tiene un montón de bichos diciendo, he tenido 50 mil dólares enfrente de mí, nunca me di cuenta. ¡Qué oh cosa! Oh my ¿Y, God. y él se atrapó a los Marshall ¿o qué No, él andaba escondiéndose acá en el país. Así es. Cara vemos. <ríe> Ey, pero dígame, ¿cómo ha estado? ¿Qué ha estado haciendo? Le ha dedicado un poco de tiempo y la felicito porque ha perseverado, ¿eh? Ha perseverado. Ay, gracias, pero ahorita me siento perdida, pinche. Nah. ¿Todavía sí. habla y eso es bueno? Sí. Quiero que sea honesta. Uh -huh. varios, varios comentamos que si hubiéramos seguido con usted más tiempo, hubiéramos aprendido más. Mm. Hemos tenido, bueno, teacher, pero la metodología quizás no fue uh -huh. como la mejor que tuvimos. Entonces, de hecho... Hubieron unos que desertaron por eso, porque no estaban como ya. O, acuérdense que dependiendo del teacher, o uno se motiva y sigue, o uh -huh. se queda. Ahí. Entonces, <ríe> Entonces, los que nos quedamos así como dándonos ánimos, no, ya va a terminar este módulo, ya no van a cambiar, pero por el siguiente. Entonces, por eso es que a veces usted dice que, que nos siente como que estamos un poco atrasaditos. No, yo he oído eso, eh, como eso, usted que dice, pero es que no sé si me entienden o qué. Pero es porque a veces... Es que no cuando les veo la cara, yo, yo sé, Ajá. yo me identifico cuando son... Ajá. Pero, ok, no me entendieron, ok, vamos a ver. Sí, pero es, por, es, pero es por eso, porque estamos como, nos hemos, como hubo un momento como que nos estancamos. Entonces, si sí. sí, pasamos un, varios módulos que ni siquiera hacíamos grupos. Entonces, es, hubo un teacher, éramos 24, y esperaba pasar uno hasta el 24 para hablar. Esa era la metodología que tenía. Entonces, sentíamos que no, hacíamos, que no avanzábamos. Uh 
Entonces sentimos que eso nos... Está un como, poco. Sí, nos está un poco, exacto. Entonces, si se fija, ahí va, estamos varios, pero porque nos dábamos como ánimos entre nosotros, no nos no, sigamos, o sea... Ya va a venir el, el que nos va a enseñar, de verdad. Ah, pero mire, todo tiene que ver, Carla, con la motivación de uno. O sea, si realmente uno quiere aprender, no va a dejar las cosas tiradas. Pues sí. por, por muchos altibajos, y eso no es solamente con esto, es en la vida. O sea, usted quiere aprender algo y usted, más que yo, usted es profesional. Usted sabe que algunas cosas le costaron más que otras, ¿verdad? Sí. Fíjense que en realidad sí, yo siento que he avanzado bastante. He aprendido bastante, eh, porque sí lo noto, ¿verdad? pero sí también eh, pasó como ese, ese impasse que tuvimos. Entonces ahorita estamos como empezando de nuevo a agarrar como la onda, ¿verdad? porque no, con usted eh, aprendemos todos los días algo nuevo. Entonces el mismo ánimo que usted le pone a las clases nos ayuda a nosotros. <risa> Gracias. Entonces, ahí como que vamos agarrando de nuevo el hilo. Esperamos que pues no dejen varios módulos con usted. <ríe> Mil, uno o dos, y ya después nos lo vamos a decir. No sé, no sé, no, ahí es que acuérdese que, pues, si uno se va, ¿qué se hace? ¿Me muero? ¿Qué van a hacer? No, hombre, usted. Está muy joven para pensar en eso. <ríe> no, pero, no, si supiera usted las que me han pasado este año. Eso es horrible. Hoy sí, hace poco se murió una amiga que tenía 35 años. Mire, si así fue. Y de la nada, sí. Le dio un ataque al corazón. Aquí en, en galería, dicen que andaba. Y ah, la de la, de la noticia. Mariam. No uh -huh. sé si la había. Así fue, un pues compañero sí. de trabajo estaba trabajando y ahí le dio un... Un, un aneurisma, un quizás, o algo así. A saber, pero ahí, ahí un aneurisma fue, o sea, un infarto y ese aneurisma, o sea, ya no le llegó sangre al cerebro. Y, uh -huh. ahí Ay, quedó. qué triste. Y acababa de, de regresar, no, el día siguiente regresaba el hijo de, de ver al papá en México, no o sé, sea, uno en Europa. Uh -huh. Ese hijo la vino a encontrar ya. Qué bien feo, triste. bien feo, pero Dios sabe lo que así es que la única realidad que tenemos, ña Carla, todos nos vamos. Ay, sí, sí, la vida es prestada, hoy estamos y mañana no. Pues sí, por eso hay que disfrutarla, hay que, hay que hay darle el sabor a la vida. Y eso en inglés es, es eso, es eso, créame, sí. le abre la mente a uno, le, da, le abre puertas, ventanas a uno, no se imagina ahí, pues Dios se la va poniendo a uno. O sea, de que ánimo, ánimo, en cualquier cosa, mire, si de verdad quiere aprender, escríbame. No se preocupe, digan, mire, ¿cómo hago para mejorar esto? Yo he notado que estoy fallando en esto. El uso de have. Empieza a practicar eso de cuando ocupa have como verbo, como auxiliar. Porque si sí, le he escuchado varias cositas. Oye, I need only one person. Decía, yeah, because only have one option. Because it only has one option. Because I only have. El sujeto se nos olvida al usar have. Ok. No, ajá. Él lo vamos a ir viendo, pero no se preocupe. Sé para ayudarle, oye. Gracias. Cuídense mucho, Carlita. Enjoy the night. Gracias. Good night. Bye bye. Bye.